Hello and welcome back to God of War, played on Booster Roid. And let's open the door. Alright. Yeah. Oop. Need to find a couple of points to strike with the chisel. I don't think there's always two. It can be up to four if I remember correctly. You killed Mag. That he did. He was a god, but you killed him. Then he got Aesir, perhaps, but I. In his father's store. Not minor, not minor at all. Him. This will not go over well in Asgard. I defended us. Nothing more. I fear no judgment. Judgment, no. But if vengeance is any concern. Who can you kill a god? Everything can be killed. Thinking about Dante's Inferno as well. Damn. Other God of Wars. And Baldur's Gate a little bit. No, 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 no. Once you retrieve the whetstone. Please take utmost care while handling. Yes, I know. I'm just wondering how to open this. Okay, because it shows runes. I'm... There's one over there. Um... Oh. It looks like this one was the closest. And don't get me wrong, my logic can be... Huh. Not true at all. I wished he would tell me that before I jumped onto those knobs. I don't know what those are. Um, because honestly, I don't see a thing. Okay, let's talk with Sindri for now. Maybe I'm completely wrong and it's somewhere bless you. In here. Wait, we were here before. But which way back? Hey! Did you hear? Magni, the Aesir god, son of Thor? Dead! I know! Now Modi's on a rampage across Midgard, looking for the killer, swearing that once he finds him, he'll... Oh shit, that was you guys. We should probably discuss that more quietly. Or not at all. I think that's a great plan. What yeah. speaks to you? Let's not discuss that at all. Um, yes, yes, yes. Uh, not bow. How about you, young one? You just cut trees with that, right? Some bloody trees, yes. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And I believe this is the one we found. After all, why not? That looks amazing. Yeah, a little worse on the strength part, but 
It's still better. Um, I don't suppose you could try keeping that clean. Nope. Okay, the other thingy. It will be a little bit harder to kill that something. Um, okay, and waste armor. Yeah. None of them. Never mind. Uh, have some resources. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Please give me a resurrection stone. Mm-hmm. I believe it is. Maybe we should upgrade, up, upgrade some more. Yes, I know. Why will you show me what I just sold you? I know I sold it to you. Okay. Funny piece of work. It, if I say so. Myself. Upgrade it to max, yeah, might as well. I don't suppose you can try keeping that clean. And mm, this one. No. I think I'm missing something. Okay, what thank else you. Was there? Yeah, Blessing of the Frost. Activate temporary power up of Leviathan Axe with small explosions of frost damage on every hit. And slight bonus to any normal attacks. Please. Also, I'm gonna change this one to. Yeah. Oh, nope. Strife of Ludgard. We'll see it. Also, the boars are for you. I like those. Oh, it's all upgraded to the max. Okay, that's one. That's two. On any successful vlog. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Uh, I'm using running attack, yes. Health, burst on any successful parry. Very low perk activation chance to gain the rage burst when damage is taken. That's most probable to happen. Eee. What's that? Returning storm. Eee. Eee. Give me this one. Anything left here? No. Okay, so we might finish the close combat and ranged combat trees. 
and just add ourselves some Spartan Rage. Great. And what else? We just go... Uh, oh, right. I don't think the lad's doing too well. I'm fine. <laughs> if so, then keep up. Yes, sir. Bless you. Hey, I just realized. Yeah. Magni didn't come back to life. That is interesting. It's known the Aesir find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant. I need to find a crystal. Oh. Okay, I need to find the explosive. You. And, and most important, thank you. And the second one, yeah, it's also important. God damn it. Reward? Yes. Did we use that for anything so far? I don't think so. Look, back near the giant's hand. What? What is this place? Fishermen would bring the day's catch into this port and use that contraption to send some of it directly to the Jarl's main kitchen. The rest were sorted and sold. There is an exit under the thumb. Find a way across. It's moving. Maybe. Bless you. There is an opening. I can get it. There's a path to the exit on the other side. Can you? Okay. Oh, it goes... Oh. Yes, please. I think that did it. Boy, you really sound sick. Even more than... I do. And I am... Not feeling too well. Yes, yeah. Give the boy some tea, god damn it.
You are a little bit off and don't want... Acknowledge that you were there. Back under his palm. We're almost there. Ah, yeah. We're back here. Everything we just did. Climbed around a dead giant. Rode a giant falling hammer. Fought some bad gods. Mm -hmm. What do you think Mother would say? Bet you have come a long way. Thanks. Right here's another one. There's something over there! I know, thank you. Ah, you see? Or do you have the mirror with three sigils? That's for you. Here, boy. Another one. Ah, you know this one, don't you? It's Thamu, the giant stone mason. Is he building a wall around Jotunheim? It was to be his masterwork. He only wanted to protect his people. Too bad the first part got burned. I prefer the last panel was burned. Such a senseless pity. <laughs> this one. The greatest stone mason and one of the biggest giants of all. He argues with his son Hrimtur, strikes him, and gets lost looking for him. Thor chisels Stamur in the head and crashes the whole town. Tamur was building a wall around Jotunheim to protect giants from the Aesir. Did the effort get finished? That would explain the hefty magical lock on the outside. But it's more than that. I have this feeling. Like something is waiting for us down here. You've a knack for ominous statements, lad. What kind of something? I'm not sure. Something powerful. Whatever you feel, boy. We will handle it. We have come this far, yes? Yes, father. So oh. oh Yeah, this is the first one. If you don't mind, I'll put a manual save over here. Because I I, I hate it. Yes, please, thank you. I'm gonna steal from the first of the night. A Valkyrie? Imprisoned? She actually did it. A Valkyrie? But I thought they were just spirits. Take caution, lads. A Valkyrie in the flesh. I can't think of a more formidable opponent. She does not attack. Does she even know we're here? That's why I hate them. I cannot see a thing. 
she's ever doing. I tried to grab the healing staff. It's not that hard. Up. Unless you're like me and you cannot block real life. Oh, ow, and I hit my head. Oh, I hit my neck. Um. block her attacks. It's not that hard. Just I'm horrible blocking. She doesn't do that many attacks that cannot be block blocked. And this is the only one. Let's see, this, this fight is terribly easy. I managed to hit that. Freed me from my corrupted form. You have my eternal gratitude. But my sisters remain trapped as I was. Take my helm. Find them. Free them. The fate of the Valkyries rest on your shoulders. A 
fate of the Valkyries. Sounds pretty important. That's putting it mildly, lad. What do you know of them? A fair question, and yet not one easily answered. I know more than most, but much of their history is veiled in secrecy. My own experience with the Valkyries ends with my imprisonment. You are avoiding the question, Head. As I said, brother, it's complicated. I don't know why or how they become such wretched creatures, but perhaps if we can free more of them... You want us to find more of those things? The fate of the Valkyries, lad. A more worthy endeavor there is not. It will be dangerous. Well, that hasn't stopped you before, eh? Hmm. That's the spirit. I see another chest over there. And I swear I can... Let's get them. There it is. Oh, oh it's not another chest. It's the same that I've already opened, right? Or is it for some reason closed? Oh, it's already open. Yeah, so there's that. And believe it or not, originally this wasn't the first Valkyrie I've defeated when I played it the first time. Uh, the first one was in the Muspelheim. It was a torture. It was horrible and it was one of two things that broke my game, so I couldn't complete it. I mean, the, I couldn't get the platinum for that. Hmm. Hopefully now I'll do everything in the correct order and we will get this done properly. Huh? No, there wasn't anything else. But we can still, yeah, we still cannot use those fast travels. Ish. What now then? Maybe Freya ought to have a look at the boy. No, yes. I feel better now. I just needed to catch my breath. Where do we go next? To Freya. Now that we've got the giant's chisel, we need to learn the travel room to Jotunheim, so we can carve it into that special gateway atop the peak and open realm travel to the land of the giants. You don't know it? Alas, no. But the serpent did mention that the giants had entrusted that secret to Tyr. Isn't Tyr dead? Aye, but his hidden boat is very much in reach. The doors are beneath his temple, submerged in the lake for generations until our snake friend shifted his weight. There we shall find the fabled Black Rune of Jotunheim. We could also explore some more. We got that chisel now, and that vault isn't going anywhere. Seems a shame to waste the boat. We shall see, boy. Yeah, we will explore some. And I'm gonna <laughs> and I'm gonna collect some more hack silver from these barrels. Okay. Obviously the marriage to Odin didn't last. But how did Bran end up a hermit in the woods? Oh, that was a singular piece of cruelty, even for Odin. As if the marriage wasn't punishment enough. Freya was better to him than he deserved. She stuck it out through all manner of indignity, all in the name of maintaining peace and safety for her people. But Odin's madness, his tyranny, his corruption of her magics, it became more than she could stomach, and at long last she broke it off. Odin's wrath was fierce, and his curses upon her were more than she dared to fear. But her magic was so much stronger than her. After so much time together, he knew her vulnerabilities, and exploited them to craft curses she could never break. Oh, like not being able to leave Midgard. Worse still, he robbed her of her warrior spirit. Freya cannot fight, even to defend herself. No living thing may she harm by blade nor spell. How oh, well, this belligerent? What choice does she have but isolation? Poor Freya. I guess if I was her, I'd spit in your face too. I lie. So would I. We can beat about here. Perfect. What's that? Not something I can... 
Oh, hi. I was trying being nice. Why don't you... I'm still waiting for him to do the thing. Another mirror. Uh -huh. I think this is something. Give me a moment. Oh, Atreus, follow me. Sorry, I got distracted. Yeah, I know. And I think this is a good place to end this part. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive. Oh, and see you soon. Bye.